subscribe to our youtube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to get all the latest updates so this is a self home rapid antigen test uh, covid find by meru in a little aluminium uh, wrapper it contains the actual test kit there is a swab a uh, extraction tube with buffer prefilled in it and an instruction booklet inside the instruction booklet you will also find a disposal bag so this is the actual test kit there's a qr code there is a c and a t so I'll come and there's a little well where you will put the solution If there is a C line but there is no T line then it's a negative test if there is a C line and a T line it's a positive test very important to be mindful that even a very faint T line indicates a positive result Uh, keep in mind that you shouldn't have eaten or had anything to drink for at least uh, 30 to 60 minutes before the test. You shouldn't have brushed or uh, used mouthwash just before the test. Really important is to get the tonsils on both sides, and then get the back of the throat behind. Uh, there's a fold at the back, so you just go behind that. It takes about five to ten seconds to get a good sample. Don't touch it to your tongue or to your teeth, and don't. We're not trying to get spit on it. Using this same swab, I'm going to now take a sample from both sides uh, in my nose. So I'm going to tilt my head slightly backwards, and I'm going to put the swab flat. So I'm not going to go upwards. So tilt your head slightly backwards, about three, two to three centimeters. I'm going to do five rotations on one side. I'm going to gently withdraw the swab, and I'm going to do the same thing on the other side, about five seconds on each side, just to show you what I'm doing. I'm going to put the I'm going to put the swab in and I'm going to rotate it now 10 times. Now I'm what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and remove all the liquid from the swab. So I'm going to squeeze the plastic as I pull the swab out. So remember this is the well. I'm going to put 5 four to five drops over there. So So I've put four drops on that. I've already performed hand hygiene. If you're at home either wash your hands or use sanitizer now we're just waiting for the test um, for the test it takes about 15 minutes so if you have symptoms is really important you can use this antigen test at home so now importantly after we finish the test so remember that there's this disposal bag so you take off the put in all the materials that are used i'm going to put in the test everything all the all the bio waste that are generated here i'm just going to put all of that into this bag seal this and then dispose of this as biomedical waste or biohazard waste it's great to see you here thank you for watching our work if you haven't subscribed yet don't forget to click the bell icon and subscribe to watch our story and support independent robust journalism